we have behind us, gentlemen? 1936 Farmal F20. And how did uh, you, Cole, get started in wrenching on fixing equipment? Uh, I grew up working on stuff with my dad and my grandpa. And dad and grandpa restored a couple tractors when I was little. And that's just grew up. We have a construction company. We fix machinery all the time. Mitchell? Uh, my story is pretty similar to Cole. Um, I've kind of grown up um, around my dad and grandpa restoring tractors and uh, fixing farm equipment. And so we finally just got to the age and we decided this would be a cool thing to do at school. And Cole, how did we come upon this uh, F-20? Where did this come from and what's the story about how we got to restore it for the contest? Uh, we heard from a friend that there's a bunch of tractors at a abandoned farm that was getting sold. And uh, we went and looked at them and we bought five tractors, including this one, and uh, brought them home and this one sat and we decided we were going to restore it. And how did you hear about the Chevron contest? I've seen it in Antique Tractor Magazine. They had a picture of the year before winner, the tractor in there, and it said you could read the store tractor, and so I brought it up to you guys. Okay. And Mitchell, what was uh, what was one of the biggest challenges on this tractor? Uh, the biggest challenge for us was well finding bushings or wore out stuff that isn't made anymore. So we built a lot of our own parts for the steering and front end that kind of got sloppy. Um, another difficult thing to find was the paint that this this color gray was discontinued in 1936 right after this tractor was made so it was kind of tough to find something that would match it okay and if you were still in school would you do this again Definitely. yes yep. all right Cole Deegan Mitchell Pettis St. Peter Senior High School FFA chapter this is our 2019 submission for the Chevron Dello Tractor Restoration Competition.